guys, welcome back. It's me Anushka if you're new here. And if you are new, make sure to press the subscribe button. You know, don't forget to do that. So today I'm gonna to be doing the Google Picks My Makeup challenge, which was I believe created by Nikki Tutorials. And hers one was so fun and colourful, and I've seen it a lot lately on YouTube, so I just wanted to do mine. Um and just wanna see what comes up on my name. Before I go on to the video, I'm gonna do my post notification shout out as always. And today's one goes to Sana16. Thank you so much for your comment. If you guys wanna get a post notification shout out next time, all you have to do is press that bell button once you have subscribed and comment in the comments below when you have done so and you can just write say done or anything, anything you want really. And yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna go on Google Images and I'm gonna write A-N-K look. That's my initials. Go in images. Okay, okay, okay. This little girl, woman, I don't know, <laughs> posing. I mean, it seems quite challenging actually, but shall we just do this? So I do some, see some like baby pink, beige, blacks definitely, greys, white. A little bit of orange actually in the light things on the parking thing. But that's it really. We're gonna first do the eyes and I'm gonna prep my lids with the Tarte Shape Tape Concealer. So I'm just gonna blend this all over my lids with a brush. You can use any brush you want. I like to use this fluffy like dense kind of eyeshadow brush. I do used to do it with a beauty blender but I just feel like it took away too much product. I'm gonna take these two shades right here. They actually look like very much like the colors, like this could be the wall color, this is her like dress color. This is the NYX Lid Lingerie palette, it's like one of my favorites and I do actually have a top eyeshadow palette video coming soon. But first I'm gonna use the beige and I'm just gonna pack this on the inner corner. And then I'm gonna take that baby pink shade and pop this on the lid. Just wanna pack it on. I'm just using pressing motions and I'm just gonna like blend it into the beige. I feel like colors like this don't really show well on me because of my skin color. I mean, they do show, but it's nothing like bright or anything. Oh yeah, I know. I know, Chichi. I know. Life is so hard. Gets to sleep, eat, drink, poo, pee. You know, just do whatever you want to sleep. And he's still moaning. I used to always wear big hoop earrings like this back in the day. Like, every day I would wear hoop earrings. This colour is very subtle, but it's actually really pretty in, in real life. Like, it's it's very subtle. But I want it to be like that actually. So since there is some like metal bits in the background, I am gonna use the iHeart Revolution multi liners. This is the colorful one, and there's a silver one here, and I'm gonna put this on my waterline. So since there's like black everywhere, I'm gonna put a liner. This is the Rimmel Glam Eyes liner. going to use the Tammy X Revolution um, palette, the Tropical Paradise palette. I'm going to use the black right here. I don't know what I just said right there. It's like I did a blur of words. I'm just going to smudge that on the liner. I'm just going to use this little Real Techniques brush and then smudge out a bit more. You know, sometimes I don't really want like something over dramatic. Do you know what I mean? Then I'm gonna curl my lashes as always. You can go ahead and pop any mascara on. I'm gonna use the Colossal Big Shot Mascara by Maybelline. 
And I'm not going to put too much because I am going to put lashes and it's just going to help the lashes, my lashes stick to the falsies. For lashes today, I recently been sent the Lights Camera London lashes and I'm going to use the Chelsea ones today. They looked really, really pretty and I was actually really surprised by their lashes. They're actually so nice and they come in really handy like boxes. Oh my goodness, they just fit like a gem. So I'm just going to go in with more black eyeshadow on top of the lashes. Just to make sure that everything is covered and nice and black and smoked out. Okay, I'm actually going to film a foundation review so I'm going to be right back and film that quickly and I'll be right back. Alright, so I've applied my foundation. Um, the video will be up soon don't know when but it will be up soon we're going to go on to concealer i'm going to use my tarte shape tape concealer again i'm going to use my morphe blending sponge to blend that out Next I'm going to use some of my Kat Von D loose setting powder just to set my whole face and kind of slightly bake under the eyes. Use my powder brush and brush off the excess. Before we go on to the rest of the skin, I'm just going to finish the lower lash line. I'm going to use some orange because I'm wearing an orange top. There's orange in, the, orange in the picture. So, you know, I just need to wear some orange. So I'm going to use, again, a Tammy palette and I'm going to use this orange here. I'm going to pack that on. I just feel like I'm always doing the same look. So I'm kind of happy that I'm changing it up a little bit right now. I'm going to put some mascara on my lower lashes. There's a lot of white in the picture from the light, so I think I'm going to go in with some of the white highlight that's in this palette. Okay, so the eyes are done. I don't know. I think I want to go for a black lip. I really do. So I think I'm going to do that because there's a lot of black in the picture. I'm going to use the uh, Nip and Fab Contour Palette in Deep and I think I'm going to go in with a mixture of these two and I think I'm going to use the orange as a blush because there is orange in the picture. I just popped a bit of the blush on the highest points of the cheek right there and I brought it up I'm just using my powder brush as to kind of like soften these two together and then for highlight I actually do have the nip and fab highlight palette this is the stroboscopic palette and I think I'm gonna go in so I'm gonna go in with this shade first and then put this on the top like kind of mix these two um, I haven't used these palettes in a while, so I just wanted to use them. Look at that highlight. Okay, I'm just going to set everything with my Glam Glow setting spray. This stuff smells amazing. Okay, so the lipstick I had is the Colourpop um, Lippy Stick in Ball Chick. So this is what it looks like.
again and because it's like a creamy matte i'm just gonna put pat some black eyeshadow on top of that lip Alright guys, so that's the end of this video. I had a ton of fun making it and I am actually digging this black lip, like honestly. I really hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching and yeah, let me know what you want to see next. Like what type of videos, like clothing videos, funny videos. I really want to do a Crayol video. By the way, I'm going to put a poll here. Like if you are not Mauritian, do you mind seeing like Mauritian videos on my channel, like Crayol videos? I do put subtitles so everyone can watch, but let me know. Do you like them or not? This is just a poll for my non-Mauritian followers. But I really want to do one soon, like a skit and stuff. So yeah, I just feel like I'm in the mood. Yeah, I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you next time.